Today I'm going to talk you through a problem that a lot of people have with prolific USB to serial cables. USB to serial cables are cables that are used to program uh, earlier radios, so radios not necessarily of today but of yesteryear and some of the cheaper radios that are on the market. Okay, so let's first of all load the device manager. You do that by clicking the start button and just type device manager and then click on the link. You'll see here that we've got a USB to serial cable connected to the computer. On the surface, it looks like this is installed correctly. It's got a COM number, it goes in a communications port number, which is COM4, as you can see. But it's also got an orange triangle. That indicates it's not been installed properly. So let's have a look at the properties and see what's going on. This device cannot start. OK, so that means it hasn't started properly. And it's got a code 10 error. Mm. OK. Let's have a look at the driver. So it does show that the driver is the most recent. It's the 2018 driver from July last year. And you'll see that the driver version is 3.8.25.0. So it is the latest version of the driver, but that is probably where the problem is. So how do we fix it? OK, here we go. First things first, let's open this. So we're going to then open this link here. This is a link to a page uh, by John Micklaw, uh, which explains what this problem is and how to fix it. And he also gives us some drivers to do it as well. So very, very helpful chap. So if we scroll down this page and just scroll to here, you'll see we've got prolific 3.2.0.0 driver. Now, if we pop back to here and have a quick look again, you'll see that we were using 3.8.25.0, and that's probably where the problem is. This cable probably predates that driver, and Windows 10 thinks it's being incredibly helpful by installing the latest driver, but actually, it's not. So, let's download this. Uh, we'll click Run. Why not? <laughs> Are you sure you want to run the program? This is just Windows 10 being cautious. So what I did to get there is I clicked onto this link, or this is saved in my favorites. I'll put this in the video description so you can go and get this. And then I clicked on the 3.2.0.0 exe file. Anyway, Windows 10 is asking, do we want to run this? And of course we do. Let's click yes. Okay. Yep, yeah, that's fine. It's just asking us, do we want to go ahead with this? And we do. Okay, so let's go back to Device Manager, and then we need to click Update Driver. Then click this link that says Browse My Computer for Driver Software. Then this one that says Let Me Pick from the List of Available Drivers. And then in this list, you'll see that the driver that we just installed, 3.2.0.0, is there. So click on that, click Next, wait for Windows to install the drivers, and click Close. And you'll notice that that little orange triangle is gone and if we click on here and then click properties so that was a right click and click properties we'll now see that this device is working properly so that's about it a big thanks to john micklaw for his solution on usb cables and prolific drivers and all the problems that come with them i'll put a link to this page in the video description because it's a really good read it'll get you out of all sorts of trouble with prolific drivers but that's pretty much the solution Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to be notified every time we post a new video or start a live stream.